Man, free R. Kelly, dog. Free R. Kelly. Free R. Kelly. <laughs> now, let's keep it a bug. These oh, <laughs> sex trafficking stop with this Vince, Vince, Vince McMahon sex trafficking. Stop. <laughs> oh my, we got to stop using these words, man. This, this is crazy. Victim says he defecated on her head amid threesome and instructed her to have sex with the exec- executives. Oh, my God. This is just an escort or, or what, what you call a This is a wannabe. This is a, a unknowing escort. That's what I call women like that. An unknowing escort. She's she's an, she's an unknowing. She doesn't even know what she is. She's an escort. But because <laughs> I, 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 read, I, I read the story, I might do a live stream on it. I might, but I, I probably won't because it, anno- it reading the story because I, I read the story uh, last week. It, it just annoyed me because it's the same shit. It's the same bullshit with these ladies getting hired as an assistant, getting paid, having sex with all the b- bosses, all the executives. They get paid off and they still not satisfied with the payoff. And when they're not and when they not paid off uh, w- what they think they deserve, then they start releasing the dirt on the stuff. And now she's talking about she was sex trafficked. That's what I was trying to tell you, people. Stop talking about R. Kelly's guilty and all this stuff just to appease the bitches. Because now bitches are just gonna start using these terms. Sex. That's not. There's no. That's no sex trafficking going on, bro. If there's sex trafficking going on, you'd be missing. Stupid hoe. Anyway, let's read the <laughs> the article uh, a little bit. So, to sum it up, Vince McMahon is being investigated for sex trafficking allegations. And he recently stepped down. I'm going to sum it up because I already know the story. He stepped down. So the former employees called Janelle. Her name is Janelle Grant. Grant filed a lawsuit accusing McMahon of sexual abuse and trafficking. McMahon denies the allegations and believes the federal investigation will clear his name in her lawsuit. Grant detailed disturbing incidents, including an alleged threesome where McMahon defecated on her head and claims of being trafficked to other executives in the WWE. Like I told, I told you guys in the future. Especially with like this OnlyFans stuff, when the OnlyFans get shut down, or once seeking arrangements get shut down, and those girls turn 30, 40 years old, they're gonna be dropping lawsuits on these dudes. So you guys better watch out with these, especially the only yeah, the OnlyFans girls. They're gonna to be talking about they got tricked into doing this, <laughs> they got trafficked, all this stuff. The seeking arrangement girls, the, the the ladies on the sugar sugar sites, they're gonna be dropping lawsuits left and right once they hit their their late thirties and forties. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> you because know, because now i'm like oh so it's sex trafficking now if, if you if, if you sharing a bitch about a, a pass around i'm like oh it's gonna be a lot of dudes in trouble and to add the part where she, uh talking about he uh he he took a shit on her look man i don't know if people oh that's some freaky stuff yeah it is some freaky stuff that's that's how th- things be going down like that it be going down like that look man i be trying to tell people like because when people were trying to talk about R. Kelly and it's the, oh, but he he was peeing on his bitch. Uh, and I <laughs> shout out to Corey Holcomb, though. Shout out to Corey Holcomb. Corey Holcomb said this on his show verbatim. I, I shit you. This is what he said on his show verbatim. He said, when you got paper, you can do sh- you can do whatever you want with the hoe. He said he that's what he said. He said and he said this right here. He said you he said when you got money. No, no. He said he said this. You could be the average Joe and. And you be sweating and she don't want to hug you. But when you got paper, he said you can shit on a bitch forehead and she won't do nothing. Now, here we are. <laughs> we saw we saw what uh, they, they said that with R. Kelly, he, he was shitting on uh, a bitches. They said that with uh, a lot, a lot of a lot of other uh, rappers and other people that, that uh, OBJ, these people talking about, oh, they took a shit on me and and and, 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 and I was and, and I did nothing about it. Man, stop. He had paper. You let him shit on you. Accept your fucking L and leave us alone, bro. Oh my God! But like I said, when you got pa- when you got paper, you can you can literally you can you can literally do whatever you want with the girl, and th- and they're literally just proving it. And now she's trying to talk talk like she a victim, <laughs> to, trying to get us to feel bad for you because he took a shit on your forehead, bitch. You let him take a shit on your forehead. <laughs> what that got to do with us? You should just leave. You should certain things you should take to the grave. You, you there, there's no victims here. There's no victims here. Following a consensual affair, mind you, this is a consensual affair, a documented consensual affair. A female employee who was leaving WWE reportedly received three million dollars payment from McMahon. 
Grant's lawsuit came after this news was reported by the journal last year. Now, this is a civil suit, mind you guys. This is a civil suit. So <laughs> the staffer who was later identified as Grant alleges that she received one million dollars initially, but no further payments. I mean, I should really just stop it right there. So it, it literally shows you. She stopped getting money for whatever reason, and now she's talking about she's she got sex trafficked. No, th she should not be able to be able. She should not be able to be. She shouldn't be able to move forward with this 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 case. This is ridiculous. She's literally telling you, "I stopped getting paid. Now everybody, now I'm gonna tell everybody everything." I always keep telling you this stuff is always about money. These people be broke, bruh. Talking about why? Did, that's why I'm saying this is what. So why did she stay and let herself get shitted on? Oh yeah, they said that Diddy was sh was shitting on bitches too. But like I said, those are those are not victims, dog. Those are not victims. You got shitted on because you wanted to get shitted on. I didn't see bitches like <laughs> y'all. Hold up for a second. Let me let me man. Let me tell y'all something here real quick. Y'all remember high school or middle school or whenever this happened, where you be assigned a, a partner with a bitch, and like just just like on some school partner type shit, it, it, they'll assign you to you or. Or, or whatever or you had a dancing partner you had to dance with a bitch whatever in, in a class and then she'll have a whole fit or a conniption because she find you ugly or something or she finds you unattractive and she's like no anybody but i'm talking about they'll you'd be like and the bitch will be acting up making you look like embarrassing you in front of the whole class just because they assigned you a, a male partner that you didn't want to be with and you'll be like can, I, can we just have somebody else so she's not literally throwing up for having a fit for being partners with me? I know I'm, no, I'm, not, I'm not the only one that happened. <laughs> that shit happened to me like um, in high school where you get, I got to sign a partner to a bitch and she threw a whole fit, <laughs> right? And now <laughs> you talk about somebody shit on your forehead and you ain't do nothing about it. Man, stop. <laughs> just, I didn't see, dude, I didn't see bitch. Look, I knew like a girl, she didn't want to dance with a dude and she threw a whole fit. Oh, that happened to me. That shit, that happened to me too. Actually, that happened to me too. But I remember I saw that vividly what that happened to somebody. She threw a whole, she was like, oh, no, no, I don't, I don't want to dance, 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 uh, dance, dance uh, with, with him. And then, and then she, and she like, let's just come on. We all partnered up. And then she threw a whole fit. Now, I think now in my case, she was like, oh, no, I already have a partner. Uh, this, this, this is my partner. So like you, I've seen this so many times. And now you're talking about he took a shit on you, but you didn't you ain't leave him after that. But now you want to add that as part of the thing to make him look bad. Man, stop. <laughs> stop. I'm getting tired of this shit. Yo, take your L and move on. Now, mind you, I, I've had the opposite happen to me where I'll be like, man, I, I like I, I remember coming from a game like sweating like a like a like a like a dog. And bitches still wanted to give me a hug because I won a game or something. You know, I've been like, I've been on both sides on that end. So like, you, you'll be, you be, I'll be, I was shocked because I was like a senior in high school. You know, so the, what I'm talking about, what happened to me in terms of the partner stuff that happened to me freshman year high school. But when I was a senior in uh, high, high school, I remember coming after a game and I still was getting hugs. So it was, yeah, that was, that was weird. And, and that happened to me, um, freshman year after a game because I was freshman on varsity. Motherfuckers want to shake my hand and take pictures and shit you know <laughs> just, just 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 it's just 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 interesting how this this stuff works though <laughs> sometimes it's just interesting how this stuff works but i would say to janelle grant stop stop wasting everybody's time like stop <laughs>